What's going on, viewers of Off Grid Adventures? Me and Dano out on an adventure today, running the trap line. We just got a little adventure plan today, check some traps, and then tomorrow, Saturday the 20, 26th, is the annual CC Camp Squirrel Hunt. And we got our 22s. We're gonna run by a store and grab some bullets, make sure those things are dead on so that way we're getting all the headshots so that way we win it's gonna be an exciting day stick with us and uh, whatever else happens happens What's up guys? Okay, so this weekend we had the CC Camp Squirrel Hunt. Me and Cody, we were partners. We didn't plan it. It just happened that morning because I got ditched by Firebread and Brent. And I saw Cody at McDonald's, so I pulled up and we were partners. So, the day started off going good. We went to the first spot, uh, saw some squirrels, didn't really get to shoot at them. A few missed opportunities. Yeah. Uh, so we're heading out of the first spot. Cody sees a squirrel about 50 yards out in the field in the tree. Boom, it's not good. So we go on through the day. We end up with uh, four squirrels to take to the tournament. And um, ended up winning. Yeah, Cody won. Two times champ. In marksmanship, too. And, oh, and in marksmanship, too. Yeah, he won a BB gun, too. So yeah, after that, uh, me, Cody, his brother, Ty, and his brother's friend, we went walking around, just messing around out in the woods in the field. And right here is when I'm gonna let Cody take over. Okay, so. I, I'll just start out like this. I accidentally shot myself. There's, there's no way to put it other it's than... It's not funny. It's, it's not funny. Now that I'm okay, the, how it happened is... It's... Oh man, I don't know what to say. Let's just say this. I was not taking proper precaution on my firearm like I know that I should have been. And so, where I went wrong, number one, I had my barrel up. And instead of like holding it away from me or away from people, it was just right there beside me. And we were standing on this slab of concrete. And there's this little embankment. And I, whenever I went to step up on it, the butt of the gun tapped that embankment. And it, the gun discharged, entered into my side right here, and then went up about six inches. Luckily, the good Lord was watching over me, and it didn't hit anything important. Uh, didn't have like we went to the hospital got x-rays and scans and everything else and they said that where it's at if they tried to remove the bullet they would have done more damage but it didn't hurt anything like I'm gonna be sore for a couple weeks but that's that uh, will you please read these off to me and so <laughs> <laughs> my friends here off your adventures have uh, something for me to read you guys Number one, treat every firearm as if it were loaded. I, that was I, violated this weekend. I violated that. <laughs> you violated that one. Never point a gun at anything that you are not willing to destroy. He destroyed his man boob. <laughs> he violated that rule. I violated that rule. That rule was violated. Keep your finger off of the trigger until ready to fire. That rule? It was really semi-not violated, but the gun was discharge it wasn't kept on safety it wasn't on safety so we could say I violated that rule and number four be sure of your target and what is behind it I feel like that's violated. it don't really I've, apply it don't really apply but I feel like it's violated. <laughs> pretty much violated. I wasn't sure of my target I didn't think I was gonna get shot but 
So the moral of the story for everybody who's watching and people who are watching these videos, you probably know these and you've been taught it since you were young, like we all were. But I had been around them so much to the point of where I was far too comfortable with a gun and I just overlooked these rules that were supposed to apply every time we pick up a firearm. So like what I have to bring from this is that from now on I will definitely be more careful as we hope that y'all are. As we hope that y'all are. Like we don't like in our videos we try to do everything right and show you the best possible way to do things. Like do things the legal way, the right way. And it's hard for me to try to tell you guys to do that whenever I'm not doing it myself. But I was injured from my carelessness and I have learned from now on. Like I'm not guns are bad now and I'll never shoot again, but I will definitely be way more careful when I have one. Alright. Well, I guess that's the end of this video. Uh, we just want to make sure that all y'all are safe out there. Um, have a great rest, rest of your week. Keep supporting us through this next year. Uh, we got, we're got we trying to get some videos out for y'all. Trying to do a lot more stuff for you. Um, but just remember, be careful. Um, God bless and remember, make every day an adventure.